Melvin Wong is the final entrepreneur for tonight. He has a fascinating business idea and that is a matchmaking website. But will the judges be fascinated? My name is Melvin Wong and I'm the CEO of Just Mobile. My company, as the name implies, is the uh, mobile application service provider. We develop mobile applications. For example, like for the H iPhone app, is one of our apps that we have done. Now, the irony about my company is we're not so just mobile. We have also explored other areas, especially into IT and also technologies. My idea for the Make the Pitch show is actually a website for beautiful people. It's an online dating website for people to find partners which are also beautiful. Not so long ago, my friends said that he's looking for a partner and obviously he's looking for an attractive and smart girlfriend. Bro, I want to find a pretty girlfriend. I think you should find a girlfriend that is really good and loyal to you. That is the most important thing. I think you can still find a pretty girlfriend, right? Yeah, but where to find those girls nowadays? crossed my mind saying that why not we have a website. There is always a need for people to find attractive, beautiful partners in their life. So we believe this website will be able to cater for such needs. The difference between this beautiful people website compared to Facebook is our website is more into online dating and Facebook is generally a social networking website. So that's the main difference between our website and Facebook. It is not me to judge or the website to judge who is beautiful or who are not. Basically, the members of the website would judge via votes. Why I think people will like the website, there's always a need for beautiful people, especially in relationships. Once it's done, come to our website, we'll ensure that you will find the right match. My name is Melvin Wong. I'm here to propose my business idea, which is to build an online dating website for beautiful Asian people. Yeah. Well, with this website... Why only Asians? Eh? Mm. Well, uh, the good thing is, um, generally people like or judge people in Asian sense girls. of looking for someone who looks like them or um, share the same um, uh, geographic location or share the same religion, race, etc. So we, f we feel that um, Asian is a, has similarities in terms of attraction. Will we qualify to be on your website? Um, it is uh, not for me to judge. Uh, <laughs> I <can probably> not. <laughs> but, uh, generally, the website works this way. Um, someone will register themselves, upload their photo on the website, and the current members will be the one that vote in, on your profile. So if you get enough votes, at least like 10 votes in 10 days' time, 10 positive votes in 10 days' time, it means you're in. How do you know the photo is genuine? Uh, that's a very good question. Um, generally, I believe um, when we upload um, our profile, our photos upload into a website, we tend to um, give accurate information about us. Um, unless people are trying to be cunning or they have other um, um, intentions. So what's the revenue model? How does the company make its money? The revenue model is this. Um, we aim to achieve um, 5 million beautiful members in about 5 years' time. And of these 5 million people, we expect that 1% of them will pay at least 50 ringgit a month to join and to interact with other members. This equates to about 30 million ringgit revenue per annum. So, but the beauty thing is that, um, correct me if I'm wrong, uh, gentlemen, uh, in the Asian um, culture, men usually pay. So we were not going to charge the woman. We're not going to charge the woman, I mean. Um, generally, we're going to charge the men because uh, if you were to know about most online dating websites, 60 to 70% of dating websites are men. So those are our target market. <laughs> those, are our, those people are the one that we want to charge. Sure, but do you guarantee the men after paying $50 a month, do, they, do you guarantee them some dates? <laughs> or do I just get to look uh, at the photos? Yeah. If I'm just looking at photos, I can look at photos in the magazines too, you know? Exactly. I mean, that, that, that's and a very they, they do have lots of photos of beautiful women as well. Correct. Um, it is, uh, we only provide a platform. We don't really um, help in the sense of matchmaking them with yeah. each and every one. Um, what we could do is this. Um, we will allow them to message Mm -hmm. other members on our website. Now, if they do not get a reply within, say, seven days' time, mm -hmm. we will return them 
a credit which they could further um, pursue and further message. Marvin, you're a serial application <laughs> developer, aren't you? Um, yeah? We, Looking at your we multiple to. development. And why dating service? Looks like the judges are not convinced with his pitch. But the question is, why would Melvin create his website? Why dating service? Are you single? Yes, I am. Have you asked your lady friends whether this would be an attractive <laughs> you know, solution? Something they crave for? Because in the video I saw the guys, and of course the guys just want to see <laughs> beautiful women. Yes. You know? And the ladies will tell you, I want to meet smart, intelligent, funny guys. You Correct. Know? Have you tried to ask your lady friends? That, that is a very uh, legitimate question. In fact, um, we, we ask, what did they say? Yeah, we asked the man, we asked the woman. Um, generally, I think it's fair to say that it's very easy to attract a man to join this website because um, men generally go for attractive women. Um, women for the woman's side, um, we believe that um, generally women likes to be beautiful and they have a, a, a perpetual pursuit to to, to, to be beautiful. Yeah, but, but, and, but, but why you focus on the beautiful people? I mean, you know, okay. I, I don't know. I'm not beautiful, but I imagine beautiful people won't have problems dating, <laughs> so they don't need a dating service. Exactly. Oh. Perhaps those that have problems dating, which is not uh -huh. that beautiful, requires the service. So uh -huh. why do you say dating service for beautiful people? You know? Correct me if I'm wrong. Um, what if it's a dating service? Uh, beautiful people mm. tend to be a bit kind of picky towards uh, their part, what kind of partners they want. I have friends who have uh, rejected, oh, beautiful friends, who have rejected really, really um, loyal, humble people due to certain um, um, attractive criteria which did not meet their, their, no, their expectations. No, I'm sure that groups Probably of because people, they're not yeah. beautiful. <laughs> um, no, I'm sure that people, are, but I think your projections are like, then you said 5 million, 50 it? bucks per month. And for 5 million customers, is it not? Yeah, in fact, the idea is that new. Um, uh, there's a website called beautifulpeople.com. Okay. Uh, you can Google it. Um, currently, they have 5 million members and they have been around for 10 years. They have 5 million members. Right. And we actually duplicate or imitate the same idea for the Asian market. So, we, but the thing is that we're going to create a different differentiation. They are more into the Western okay. um, area. We are one to focus on the Asian market. What's, what's the sustainability formula? I mean, you know, people come see beautiful people, yes, and they, they rate them. And then at the end of the day, the beautiful people don't want to have to do anything with the, the, the ugly people. Uh -huh. then, then, then what? You know, then, uh -huh. then people leave the site, right? They don't come back. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's results that matter, as yeah, like what Tia has mentioned earlier. Yeah. If yeah. you don't get the results, what sustains the volume? Yeah. Uh, we believe um, if there is enough pool of people inside there, and of course, it's not me to, 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 to match, match you with people, it's up to you to message them. Having said about all the numbers and everything else, sure. who decides which, or how do you decide which are the pretty girls compared to the... <laughs> The members. The members. Yeah. the members themselves? Yeah. Correct. So the guys... But the number of hits it goes at... But the number of hits that they get, is it? Number of hot, uh, hot oh. bots or no, not hot bots. Oh. Yeah. They could all be stalkers for a week, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Do they have to be single as well? Oh, <laughs> yeah. that's a very... Uh, okay, very. Thank, okay, thank, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you, thank you so thank much. You, Will Melvin's idea in uniting couples through his website be accepted by investors? My feeling was... It's very clear that uh, the judges knows what this website's about. And they sounded quite interested with the website. Well, generally, I guess, because most of them are guys. And um, I think it should be quite a positive um, feedback from the judges. Conflict, um, I have not got any hard questions from the, the judges. Most of the judges understand uh, what the website's about. And it just they want to understand more deeply about how the website could sustain itself and how it could be viable, feasible for the market. So I think generally uh, the website has a market because it has another kind of website similar in the world. It's just that we, are trying to, we have found a very differen differentiated um, factor for us to differentiate against the rest. So I think it should be, shouldn't be a problem for that. Going for the next stage will be an, a bonus, I believe, because um, this website, I, without or with without this um, program, I believe um, I will continue to pursue to build this website. Of course, I hoped me and the judges would share the same interest to move this idea forward to the next round and hopefully we can finally land to investment from either of the judges. They were pretty funny and they were pretty laughable about the idea and I don't think I have any questions that came from the judges that made me felt down. It was very legitimate questions they asked. We have seen Yogapati, Mama Sofian and Melvin gave their pitch. Find out the outcome after this break.